Welcome to the Nicholas 11x12 technology. Today I've finally gotten a chance to do a quick comparison with the new NVIDIA GTX 980 Ti graphics card. In this video I'll be comparing it against its smaller brother, the GTX 980. The price difference isn't exactly small, but we'll see if it's really worth it paying more for the GTX 980 Ti and how much more performance we can expect from it. So without further ado, let's bring on the benchmarks. Alright, Nvidia did a fantastic job once again, but that's no news to us anyways, for the most part. No matter which game I throw at the GTX 980 Ti, it beats the 980 by miles, and that's really impressive considering it's still a single GPU card. The temperatures are a bit on the higher side already, but for reference cards that I've tested here, that's still not too bad. Lots of room for improvements with aftermarket coolers. As for power consumption, I'm really surprised on how Nvidia does their magic. When seen proportionally, the power consumption didn't really increase as much as the performance did over the GTX 980. What is Nvidia doing? Doing. I'm assuming they're practicing some kind of black magic, but hey, I'm okay with that. Price performance wise, well, that's a bit hard to judge. Both cards are kind of pricey and not GPUs you'd go for on a tight budget. Let's put it this way, the 980 Ti costs roughly 40% more than the 980, but in terms of performance, it's almost offering about 40% more power as well, while offering 2GB of additional VRAM, so altogether we get 6GB on the 980 Ti. And yeah, that's it I guess. I hope this video could illustrate the performance difference to you between these two graphics cards. Stay tuned for more, next time I'll try to compare it with the Titan X, if I can get my hands on one. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and visit nicholas11x12techx.com to see videos there earlier than on YouTube.